It was a three minute fight on my front porch of her trying to get in, to get into my house with my kids. And all I kept saying, like, this isn't happening today. A West Kelowna family is saying enough is enough after a naked woman broke into their home and assaulted them on a Sunday afternoon. I hear someone screaming and my dog's barking. So me and my son go out on the porch. We see a naked woman coming up the stairs, full on raging. I hear banging on the door and then the door starts cracking. Drop the phone, lunge myself, two hands at the door, pushing on it as hard as I can. The frame starts cracking and her head starts poking through the door. Breaks through the door and I lunge at her and I scream just as loud as she's screaming. So we have each other by our hair the whole time. She's punching me in the face, she's kicking me. Then she was looking up at me and I said, you need to leave, you need to leave. And she's kept repeating, let go of my arm. And I said, I can't. It is not safe. I have kids in this house. I said, if you need help, I can help you, but you need to leave now. So I let go of her arm. Next thing I know, she turns around and comes running back to the house full speed. And she goes and hides. Cops go down looking for her in the canyon or in the creek. So they get her. They have to, bang, they have to break down both wooden doors to get her out as she's screaming naked, throwing her in the back of the SUV. We're sick of this. We've, we've, we knew this was going to happen. We've gone to city council. These people, she shouldn't have been here. There's all these migrant workers who are illegally staying in these dwellings around us. The, the vineyard owners and that, they're not living on these properties. They're not having to deal with these things. They bring them and put them next to our property. And, and we have to deal with their issues. We're sick of it, going to deaf ears, to going to city council, to going to bylaw, and for nothing to happen. The family said that they expect the area to be cleaned up and that proper practices will be put in place. For Castanet News, I'm Alana Kelly in West Kelowna. Read letters to the editor in our letters section under the opinion button in the yellow masthead. Email your letters to letters at castanet.net.